Do oh. the intro. Hi, me Dan. This time we play game. Yes, Hello. us. Fishies. That was a terrible intro. That's going to be the official intro from now on. Oh, Good. Okay. That's the intro that's going to be used in every video. Good. Good. Except I need to add something into it too. Um, I'll really add this should've. at the end. Look, he was on a bird. Elk, he landed. And he just he went to like the water, eyebrows? did something, then yeah. he went left the water, and I was like, okay. Make sure to Wait. watch and subscribe. What the? Hi, me Dan. This Tom. We play game. Yes, Hello. us. Fishies. That was a terrible intro. Make sure to Wait. watch and subscribe. What the? Okay, let's go. <laughs> okay. So you throw my tab on the screen. You like tap and like hold to throw. Like it makes like Does an arc. No buttons work. Nope. Like. I'll work. It's a bit frustrating. If you're already tapping the screen. Oh, how do I how do I tell him to um, like throw it at him? Okay. You have to like aim. This is the worst aiming. No, it's not. Little bitches, come here. Get fucked. Holy off. crap! How'd you do that? Just tap the screen really fast. Look at their little ghosty bodies. What are they carrying? Their carcasses. What? As food? Yeah. Okay. Beaches. How do I do the whistle thing? Go get the thing. L. Hold it on over him. What? Hold your button over him and then press L. <gasps> Everything's like touch. Yep. Wow, it's the future. Don't you have to use one hand to press the button and one hand to do that? It gets kind of annoying. Yeah, this is a bit annoying. In the other game, you just use like one stick to do this. Yeah, and go back like... over there. They're making babies though. Yeah, but you can probably get something else so you don't have to come all the way back here, all the way back, and then all the but way back over we there. we might need all the babies. And I like babies. Uh -huh. pretty cute. I'm a little cute. I've got a feeling there's a Lego down. Tom, why is it always gotta be like that? Because the law says so. I'm sorry. Well, laws can change. Alright. Are you pro pedophilia? Secretly. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm a gay fucking necrophiliac. <laughs> Good. Oh my god, okay, so the other day, we lived in Michigan, as you probably know, because... I told you we needed more little losers. Well, I mean... Them. I was talking about going that way. Good volunteers. So you can get all of them. Continue about Michigan. <gasps> Five. That one is huge. That's what they always tell me. Yeah. She loves me, she loves me not. She loves me, she loves me not. She kills me, apparently. I'll just die. I just fall on and die. Um, so, I live, we both live in Michigan. Um, so, who are we straight up. allies with the moment? The Texans? Or... We're he... allies with our fishies, Curtis. The fishies, okay. The fishies. They're, they're adorable. Um, we, uh... And Dan didn't go, but I did with a couple other friends. We went, I went to, um, the, the Avenged Sevenfold Breaking Benjamin concert. I'm jelly. It was actually pretty good. And, um, but like, I was kind of out of it. I was tired and stuff. And, um, so like at the very end, like they, you know, they did their show and then there was an encore, of course. And it was like... They did like three songs, and the very last one was Little Piece of Heaven. You know, the entire concert was just like, yeah, woo woo! And then they did Little Piece of Heaven with, and I didn't realize it was Little Piece of Heaven because I was super tired and didn't even hear the chorus. But they just showed, like, the animated official mm -hmm. music video. Have you seen that? No, but look at the one loser. You if you just watch the music video and not even listen to the words, it's the story of a man who proposes to his wife. Oh, you told me about this. Or to his girlfriend. And, um, she, she, uh, says no, laughs at him, knocks the ring out of his hand, um, he, he kills her, eats her heart, has sex with her dead body, and then she comes back to life. I think this is a bit graphic for our viewers. I'll just link to the video. No, but you're even explaining this. They're kid, this is a kid show. I'm linking to the video. We can't swear either. Fucking link into the video. Mother. You nasty person. Fluffer. The onion is like a nest for the pigmen. It gives both birth to them. Wait, it both gives birth to them and provides them with shelter. 
It gives both birth to them, is what you said. I know I did. I'm. I. Wow. Sometimes I have trouble. You know, you have the gift of speaking English. Maybe learn how to do it a little bit better, and be fucking great. Check your privilege, sir. Good day. Good. Day. Maybe I'll start speaking Spanish. Don't do that. That would confuse many people, especially me, because I can't speak it. I want to learn to speak French, but I can just... tell you something very nice. Yeah. I won't. What damn? I was gonna say you're ugly. Oh. You want to say Spanish? Yeah. Yeah. yeah how how do I say Spanish. It? Say tu eres feo. Tu eres feo. Yeah. You are. Ugly. Curtis. Tu eres feo. Hmm? Tu eres feo. I can do fat too. You know what my fat in Spanish is? No, I don't want to know that. Make me sad. Are you asking me? It's because very I'm fat? similar wow. to handsome. Handsome. Handsome is cool. Oh, you mean like it's the same word it's, in Spanish? Basically, it's close. What's in handsome? In Spanish, handsome is guapo. Guapo. Yes, guapo. It doesn't seem to be a good word for handsome. Earth does destroy the like forest. You want to know what beautiful is? What? Bonita. I I know that. And there's another one. It's like Linda hey, or something. Game. I'm teaching you Spanish. I'll put the it's game okay in the kitchen for Spanish. Fuck the you. Forest. I'm learning about little dudes. No, so teach me Spanish, though. They can read. Yeah, they can. Blah, blah, blah. But I kind of need to read it, too. I was installing something. Okay. So, you want to know what that is? to install it? Yeah. You know? It's Gordo. Guapo and Gordo? Yeah. Don't mix them up. We're talking to a Spanish guy. You're a guapo Gordian. I don't think Ch Captain Charlie wrote this data file. So who did? Whoa, 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 whoa. Did, 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 did. Could there be other intelligent life forms on this planet? Probably not. They all find, follow you mindlessly, oh, so yeah. I don't know. Come on, slaves. He's right, part of the Red Pikmin, see? Yes. You might have to go that way. According to the radar, the Drake should be through here. Nothing bad could happen, right? Cutscene. Ooh, more magic mushrooms. Eat it. Eat it. Oh yeah, delicious. Eat Ooh, it even sparkles for us. Little fairies come out. It's pretty. Aw, uh, I keep moving. I don't want you to be too happy. Oh, you jerk. Those are massive, but they don't look edible. That's what she said, but I proved her wrong. I mean, they don't really eat it. They don't they consume do. it. It's they, not nutritional. They value. bang it to death. Who built this wall here? More signs of intelligent life? No, maybe it's just a fucking wall. Can we think about that? Like a cave wall? Knock, knock! Is anybody do do home? That? How do you do that? I said knock, knock with my mouth. Do you need help saying that with your mouth? No, how do you get past that? Oh, they're like this. They just start going at it. That's kind of cool. They're just banging their heads on the wall. Gosh. Ow. Hey, they've been training for this their whole life. I feel much better if they just ate it. Your crew can learn a lot from teamwork. Yeah, the teamwork of sending them in. Just go, yeah. slaves. Yeah, the teamwork of, oh, hey, I'll stay back. You you guys do it. You do all the hard work. I'll just, I'll just manage. Here. I'll just oh. manage. It's fine. It's Sputnik. Sputnik? There it is. The SS Sputnik. Oh, that was the Mars No, it's right? SS Drake. You know, that rap singer. He turned into like a robot. Drake. I don't know any of his music. I just know he's a rap singer and his name's Drake. So I make fun of anything named Drake and call a rap singer. Like, there's a road you're in your driver. subdivision that's like... Drake Drive. Drake Drive. And I'm like, that's where Drake drew up, grew up kids. And I'm like, I'm so cool. I learned today yeah, that there's a rap now. group. Nate, we can we can keep playing if you want. There's a <laughs> I learned today that this is a rap group named Dayton Road. That sounds terrible. Or the Dayton family, because they all grew up on Dayton Road in Flint, and they're like actually pretty popular and pretty successful. Because they grew I, up in Flint, hardcore man. They grew up in Flint. They didn't. To the seventh grade, I loved them. Fenton. Like no. tiny. Right Tiny's now, pretty tough, wasn't he? Until 7th grade, I lived in, uh, in the Super Ghetto. Not the Super Ghetto, but it was like somewhat. 
Straight up, yo. I lived in Corona Road. You heard it here first. Tom was ghetto. Yeah, that's it. At one point in his life, now he's just done. You just looked at my stomach. You're about to say fat ass, weren't you? No, I was going to say. I'm very upset. You know what? You know what? This is the end of this episode. But what am I supposed to do now? (laughs) They'll never know what we're supposed to do. Now look at his face. He's so concerned. He's like, (laughs) what do me do? What? What? I manual didn't get me this far. Uh, uh, help! I don't know what I'm doing. He looks so upset. He's like, I wasn't trained for this. No, it's this wasn't right in the now. manual. Help me. Next time on Tom and Dan. Thanks for watching our video. Hit subscribe so you'll see more.